How you doing? I'm Matt with LiftTheBarbell.com. Today I'm going to be reviewing the Titan Fitness Mini Farmer's Walk Handles. So these things are pretty simple design. It's just the sleeve, a handle, and a couple pieces of metal welded together, but they are awesome. I really like these handles, especially for a garage gym where space is a premium for me because I've only got about an eight or 10 foot by 10 foot section that I'm actually using for uh, my workout equipment. These are awesome space saving design versus those that are like long where you put the plates on both ends. These load up right here single handle so you can actually do several different exercises with them versus just carry with them for 55 dollars shipped whatever and plus whatever taxes are going to be for your local area these are awesome you can't beat it for this price so the main thing is a lot of people want to know if these are going to be off balance when you pick them up they're not i've loaded uh three plates 345s and a 25 on there at the same time so about 160 pounds per hand when I picked them up, not a problem with uh, weight distribution. Uh, they work great. I mean, the balance on them is really good. Uh, you can see here that when I picked both up with three plates on each side, it's not a problem with the way they balance. They don't swing in and hit your legs, anything like that. They're very nicely designed handles. Uh, very simple design, but they work. It's a powder coat on the handle itself. You see, I got some chalk on there. Help me grab it but it's a textured, it's not slick, it's not, uh, won't slip out of your hands easily. Uh, so it, it's nice. The welds are pretty nice on both of the handles I've got. This is on the back side of the sleeve. The front side of the sleeve, everything is, uh, it's nicely done. This uh, end cap will pop out, which is pretty annoying. Uh, they should have just glued that in. I'll wind up gluing it in. I've used these multiple times and it's popped out a time or two. I just need to stick some glue on there. This is also a plastic end cap here that can pop out pretty easy. But as you can see, the welds are nice. They're nicely constructed. Each of these handles weigh about nine pounds each. So you can add that to your total if you're carrying. So the handle itself is almost five inches long. It's the loadable sleeve length is about 10 inches. It's 13 inches on this. Uh, from the top of the handle down is about 16 inches. So I'm using standard cast iron plate, plates from Rep. They're about an inch and a quarter thick. I can get five of those plates on one handle plus a collar. So there's plenty of room to load these things up pretty heavy. Not real sure why, but one handle has a sticker and the other one don't. I don't like stickers. Uh, it's barely on there. The only reason I left it on there was for the review. We can just take that right off and now they match. So as you can see, these things take up very, very little room. And you can just stack them like that, get them out of the way. Uh, this is kind of my little storage area for various things but that's one of the main reasons i went with this titan fitness mini farmers carry handles that and the price i wanted to be able to do farmers carries as part of my workouts these don't take up very much room at all and a lot less room than the barbell style of carry handles and these work for me so so all in all if you're looking for some carry handles for your uh, garage gym or your home gym these are a good solution, $55 and you're out. I mean, $55 shipped and you've got a set of carry handles that you can do carries with. So you can load these up uh, on one side and do, you know, side bends or obliques like that. You can do shrugs with them uh, and you can do carries obviously. So these are really nice to have. They are made of metal. Uh, the, the powder coat does chip off fairly easy. So expect that they will probably rust in a garage gym setting, but I'm just loading plates on them and I'm just carrying them. I'm really not worried about that. I think for $55, you're not gonna find a better deal for carry handles unless you can make them yourself. If you're interested in a set of these, I'll put a link in the description below to these mini farmers carry handles. I don't think you'll be disappointed by them if you're just looking for something for space saving and price. Also, if you're interested in chalk, because if you're gonna be carrying heavy, you get sweaty, you're probably gonna need some chalk. Uh, this is an old protein bucket. This is where I keep my chalk. So spider's chalk is some of the best I've used. This is, it stays like this. It doesn't crumble up and become a bunch of dust. 
Uh, I've had this for a few weeks now. I use it a lot. You just rub it on your hands and it doesn't chip off and break. I mean, it does chip off a little bit, but it doesn't crumble up and just make powder. So if you're looking for chalk, I recommend that. I saw this uh, spider's chalk on Alan Thrall's channel. And so I decided to give it a try and it's everything he says it was. You can check out his video on that. I'll also put a link in the description below to that chalk if you're interested. Hey, thanks for watching this video. If you'd like to see more reviews of home gym equipment, go ahead and click that box right there to take you to the next set of videos. Don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe. It helps me out more than you know. And if you share this on your social media, I'll give you a virtual fist bump. Thanks for watching. I hope this helps you make a better buying decision.